Recently, President Trump sent a tweet to Britain's Theresa May saying, don't focus on me, focus on the destructive radical Islamic terrorism that is taking place within the United Kingdom. Having just returned from the UK, where I spent time in the House of Lords with activists, this message makes sense as the situation in UK has turned dangerous. Radicalization manifests itself in many different ways. And in the UK, the 85 Sharia councils that exist under the umbrella of the government are one sign of Islamist influence and radicalization at work. Here we see that Sharia has taken over Islam and the lives of Muslim women are at stake. I met and spoke with many women who are victims of the Sharia councils run by men who make decisions about women's lives without taking into consideration human rights. Issues of marriage, divorce, polygamy and custody of children have become so contentious that the women are now crying out for help. While there is work being done by many activists to reverse some of the damage done by these Sharia councils and to somehow make them accountable, it may be too late for UK to put the genie back in the box. Those of us who live in North America must be aware of the dangers of allowing a parallel legal system to exist. We believe in one law for all, and we must fight against the jihadist push for Sharia laws in the West. We cannot allow this menace to cross the pond and affect our lives.